Hello and welcome to a new episode and we're going to be playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links and this is for Throwback Thursdays. So, this is a pretty old game. I never played the card game but um, my boyfriend did and he tried to get me into it. It's, oh I, I thought it was amazing and stuff. But my only problem was that I didn't have cards. I, they didn't. I didn't get cards that I was like good with, and which so it didn't work out. And um, tomorrow's episode uh, is gonna be different. It's going to not be bit life I'm taking a break from bit life and I'm going to be saying that in like all my videos I'm pre-recording this I pre-recorded my last video so yeah and I honestly don't know what these really do but anyway um yeah we're just going to be just basically Fridays I'm going to start playing like mobile games but this is like an old game so I'm putting it with the throwbacks and I'm sorry for um, not posting that much last week I was so irritated that BitLife updated on me I was watching a YouTube video in which I say this in my other one because I recorded it before I recorded this one but I'm just like oh I'm still a little salty about that uh, that bit life updated and I say why in uh, tomorrow's video but anyway um we got a new box that's cool all right well we're going to be using my favorite deck in which it irritates the crap out of plumpy but Special arena unlocked. Arena code. Okay. Well, anyway, um, BitLife updated when I was watching a video. I had it on Wi-Fi, and because my data was slow, so and I fell asleep because I was exhausted, and it updated. Like really, like really. So. What's going on here? Sigh. Alex. Oh, Alex. Alex is. Ugh, I don't like that spelling. Well, anyway, it looks like she's down in the dumps. Even when she says she's pretty. Oh, wow, pervert. What? Study overseas? But I thought uh, studying at the dual academy for a while longer. This is once in a lifetime opportunity. Study abroad is a special gift that we offer only to our most elite students. I, you don't have to answer right now. You should think very carefully in what you want to do with your life. Blah blah blah. I honestly don't know because I haven't seen the um, anime for it. No, I kind of do want to. It, it's true that me and my friends are going to have to leave the dual academy someday, but we each have our own dreams that we want to pursue, so I have to get tough and strong to fulfill mine. But which will help me more, studying here or studying abroad? Hmm. When I'm unsure about the answer, Dooley always clears my head, so... What should I do? I don't know if I want to do that right now. Yeah. I'll probably do it. I honestly just want to show you guys my favorite deck, so. Yeah. 
All right. We're gonna go play. And I won't be able to read out all the cards and stuff since this is a time thing. So. I'll just do that, and all right. So we're. This is my key to victory. Maybe this will do the trick. Maybe it will. I don't know. I'm ready to duel. If you are a true duelist, special skill I expect right nothing there. Nothing less than your best strategies. Duel. duel. All right, cool. It's my turn. And which, when he gets flipped, I'm able to summon another card, but it usually gets destroyed because of my how of the defense is. Now is the time. I summon a monster in attack position. My monster's effect activates. From my hand, I activate a spell. You, you oofed. Oh. What? Time to battle. Why would Playtime I feel like they didn't mean to do that. My monster attacks. Like me confused. This. My monster's effect activates. Oh, I'm confused about what they just did. My turn is done. But this Here is basically my deck, me it's summoning and uh I draw. stuff. I'm going to set that this will be fun. because I don't know if I could would have been able to summon it right then and there. But we'll just end my turn now. My turn's over. Here I go. My turn. I draw a card. In which, if you don't understand how to use it, it can be difficult, but it's not really right. that difficult of a deck because I, I can use it. So. Alright, so both of these cards are going to be destroyed, but it's fine because I can just resummon Playtime them. Playtime is over. I attack with a monster. I know what to do. My monster's effect activates. Come on out. I, and I wonder if they got the idea of what I'm doing. Of remarkable skill, but I never back down from a challenge. My turn is done. You haven't checked me out. I'm on a roll. I draw. And it was a little upsetting that they didn't destroy that. I think they they're figuring out my plan. You know. What are you planning? And which. We have other tricks up our sleeve. I activate a spell. I'll just return those to my hand. Destroy that. Then we'll summon this. I hope you can help me. I summon a monster in attack position. Oh we'll battle. Which I really like this card right here. Because uh, once per turn, you can. Uh, oh. Let you read it again, real quick. And. Uh, once per turn, it's the bottom of the deck. You basically switch monsters, but you have to destroy this. Whenever you switch. Because if not, they have. Obviously, they can use it. And. Yeah. 
lost. There's nothing to it but to do it. What? They surrendered. Oh my gosh. Well, mm, that's a little irritating. Sorry, recording, I just had to double check that. We'll just... Um... I don't think this episode's gonna be very long, but, uh... I will... I will show you what my, my deck... Which is pretty simple. It's basically me, um continuously cycling through these so I technically never run out of cards um so for it doesn't matter what I get if I get it it's hard for me to really get a bad hand but um yeah and these are my extra cards and stuff this is the one I use the most I also like using this. This is just, isn't really, it's good sometimes, but it, it's not as usable, I guess I should say. So. And which, how many of those do I have? I have three. I'll put in another one. Take that out because yeah, I can only have five. That's what I thought. Because I don't need that compared to like the others. The others are more nicer. Gosh, if I had three of those, I don't know. Probably be a force to be reckoned with. But those are kind of hard because you have to have a you have to have a bunch of like all these all the cards like all the monsters I have you have to have them in your graveyard so but anyway we'll just skip that that's my favorite deck in the Sagesto deck and I'm working on another deck that I really like and if you guys like this and like let me know if I if you want to see more gameplay of this I will show you other decks that I like and that I've created and basically you can see the mind of my strategies i don't know but anyway thank you guys for watching and hope you guys like tomorrow's episode all right bye